I'm at Ryan Kisson Team Training Centre with Sean Terry just to chat about his runners on Sunday the 12th of May at Turfentine Racecourse. Sean, thank you so much for joining me. Yeah, pleasure Vix. So you start in race two, it's a maiden plate over the mile, you've got Viva La Victor. His last two runs have been very disappointing, obviously will be equipped with a tongue tie. I'm hoping for marked improvement, um, but I would imagine this would bring him on even if he does improve. Then in race three, it's a novice handicap over the mile. You've got Billy Spellbound. Uh, it's his second run after a rest. Yeah, this horse has got some very good earlier form. Uh, he gave us a, a really good run in Cape Town to a quality field, and things went wrong for him after that in terms of soundness. His first run back we were happy with, and he's probably going to just need this one as well, but he too will make a very good improvement. Then in race five, it's a Phillies and Mares 86 divided handicap over the 1800 metres. You've got two runners. You've got Magical Flight and Escape Artist. Yes, Magical Flight, I think her best distance is a mile, but on the standside track. I'm hoping that she can, you know, be competitive uh, on the inside course. Escape Artist has actually got the form to, to do something in this race and uh, quite, a, quite a jockey strike in terms of uh, having Richard on. So... You know, she's a little bit temperamental, but if he gets a good tune out of her, she should be there. Then in race seven, it's the Secretariat Stakes over the 14.50. You've got two runners here as well, Longsword, and that's my baby. Yeah, two nice runners, Vicky. Uh, Longsword, unfortunately, has to carry a kilo over. Um, Richard got a really nice tune out of him, and I didn't really want to change jockeys. So that's, what, that's his penalty, but he enjoys the inside course. Should be running on strongly. Uh, that's my baby. She's a decent filly. Uh, she may just need the run, but I'm hoping that I've done enough um, for her to be competitive. Then in race nine, it's a Phillies and Mares 78 divided handicap over the 1450. You've got Sahara Dawn. Um, I think the inside track is, is what she's looking for. Yes, definitely suited to the inside track. We're stepping up in distance trying the 1450 and hopefully that's what she's looking for. I'm expecting her to go well and maybe this will set her up for next time. Thank you so much for your time and I wish you all the best for Sunday. Thank you.